Keep reeling. Oh, stop right there. Oh, he's going to look at it. See it? See your bait? Wiggle it, wiggle it. Oh, he's about to grab it. He got it. He got it. He got it. Keep reeling, Augie. Keep reeling. Keep reeling. I know. I know. It's okay. He's a good one. I assume we're getting rid of this because people like to fish here, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, if people like to fish here, then it'd be important. Wait, wait, wait. Wait a second. If people like to fish here, then it'd be important to keep the population of fish going. This destroys the population. So destroying the population is worse than this weed. At bass, bass You got it, you got it. Keep reeling, Augie, keep reeling. Very nice fish, Augie. I don't even care what happened for us today, do you? I don't even care. It was already an amazing day, right? That's crazy. You'd think this city would be smarter. Oh my gosh, look. Oh my gosh. They're using that machine over there to just tear up the bottom. They're ruining bass beds all over the place right now. These city workers, or these city officials, I guess, are stupid. Because they're the ones who tell them to do this. I mean, the workers aren't, they're just doing what they're told to do, but. Wow. There might even be baby fish already There are baby fish. There's lots of little baby fish in here right now. They're killing the baby bass. They're ruining the beds. They're doing all sorts of stupid stuff. Oh, man. That's frustrating to see that right there. Look at that. They're just tearing it up. There's bass beds all over the place over there. We saw them yesterday. Well, hopefully this big fish over here that this guy couldn't land yesterday is still here. Like I said, his son and him, I think they both caught the smaller fish, but there's a big one over here that he had on a couple of times. And actually there's a third fish. There's three fish over here. It's right down here, you guys. Come down here, slowly. It's also overcast, so it's gonna be difficult to see, but I think I can find them again. Somewhere right down here, I don't know exactly where. I just saw a tail right in here. So they're still here. Oh yeah, I see a tail moving right out there on the outside of the reeds. Okay, they're still here. Let's see if we can get one of the big ones to bite. Let's get over here, guys. Try to get positioned to catch this fish. Over here. Actually, you know what? Here, we gotta. Do you see the fish right now, Augie, or no? Look, look right down in here. Hold on just a second. Keep your glasses on. Keep looking down in here. Look, see the see a movement right now? See the fish coming from that from that side? See. see him coming from the left? See him? Now he turned back around and going that way, right? See him? Okay, that's your fish. Now hold on. Stand right over here. We're gonna practice casting real quick, so that you can try to cast this fish yourself too. Okay? That's all right, you gotta learn. That was too late. There you go, leave like that much line. There you go. There you go. Open it up, go back. There you go, perfect. Perfect, perfect cast, okay? Okay, now just, just reel it up. That was just a practice cast, okay? We're gonna go cast at your fish now, okay? Okay, you see your fish? See him moving around again? Mm -hmm. Look, keep your eyes on him. See him right there? Mm -hmm. So cast that way. Uh-huh. There you go. Go for it. 
That's good. That's good. Perfect. Close your bail. Remember with your hand. Reel it, reel it, reel it fast. Keep holding your rod right in that direction, okay? Right there. Keep reeling, keep reeling, keep reeling, keep reeling. Okay, stop right there. Keep looking down there, Augie. Look at your bait. Look at your bait. Here he comes right to it. Move move it a little bit. Move it a little bit. Oh, he's about to bite it. Oh, yep. Keep your rod tip down, Augie. Your rod tip is too high. There you go. Come on, fish. Turn around and eat it. You see him? He's over there to the left right now by that floating stick. Move your bait a little bit. Try to get his attention. Reel it. Reel it. Reel it. Oh. A little bit too much, maybe. Okay, reel it up again. Throw it a, even a little bit further to the left. He's really wanting to hang out to the left right now. I think that's I think that's where his bed is over there. Like over here? Yep, straight out that way. Oh, oh. Perfect. Okay. Reel it straight in. Hurry. Close close the bail. Close. Oh, there you go. You're fine. You're fine. It closed. Keep reeling. Keep reeling. Okay, stop. Okay, move your bait. Keep moving it. Keep moving it. Keep reeling it a little bit. I don't see it yet. Oh, he's going over to it. Get ready. I see him. See him moving? Yeah. Move your bait. He's looking at it. Move your bait. He's looking at it. Oh, keep moving it. Oh, stop right there. He's going over to it. Look at him. Move your bait. Move your bait. There he goes. He's going to it. Oh, get ready. Here he comes. Here he comes. Get ready. See him? He's coming over. Move your bait. Move your bait. Move your bait. He's getting ready. Oh, he got it. Oh, oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. He'll bite it again. Here, you know what? Let me let me do something real quick. I'm gonna make your worm a little bit shorter, okay? Because he picked up just the back part of it just now. Hey, but listen, you have to be ready to set the hook fast, okay? Did you see him eat your bait? Did you see your bait? As soon as you see that happen, you have to pull, okay? You don't really need to pull that hard. Just focus on reeling hard, okay? As soon as you see him eat it, start reeling fast and pulling up on your rod, okay? There you go. Now just make a nice cast right there to the left, all right? That's all right. We'll walk over here to the left and we'll drag your bait into it, okay? Close it. Yep, real, real, real. Very quickly, quickly, quickly. Keep reeling, keep reeling. I can't see it yet. Hold your rod this way, this way. Hold your rod that way. Hold your rod far that way. Really far that way. Keep reeling, keep reeling. Keep reeling, keep reeling. Keep reeling it. I still can't see your bait. Keep reeling. Oh, stop right there. Oh, he's going to look at it. See, you, see your bait? Wiggle it, wiggle it. Oh, he's about to grab it. He got it. He got it. He got it. Keep reeling, Augie. Keep reeling. Keep reeling. I know. I know. It's okay. He's a good one. He's a good one. Keep, stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Keep your feet. <laughs> Very nice fish, Augie. Good Ow! job, girl. That hurt. That's definitely bigger than mine. Don't let him. It's a bass, largemouth bass. Yes, sir. That's a good job. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Tell her thank you. She was telling you good job. Wow. Look at that big girl. No. Yeah. Not in here. We'll let these ones back. Oh my gosh, it's red inside. Yeah. Look at that, Augie. That's a big fish. <laughs> that is a big fish, girl. Oh my goodness, Augie. I'm so excited for you right now. Yeah. Did you almost fall when you got it? No, but you were falling all over the place. This fish is giving you a heck of a time. Hey, do you have your phone on you? Do you have your phone on you? Get a good picture with her, okay? Yay. Augie. Oh my goodness. Look how fat that girl is. Alright, right, let's get her back in. Don't throw. Oh! oh. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. There she goes. <laughs> it's alright. You're, really to, to you're not really supposed to toss them. You're supposed to just set them in there gently and let them go back to their home. But that's okay. You didn't harm you didn't harm the fish. Don't worry. It's just a 
It's just a little etiquette thing. It's fine. The next you'll, fish is yours. You'll learn. Uh, I don't know. Wow. I really like watching you guys catch fish. That was awesome. Oggy. I don't even care what happens the rest of the day, do you? No. I don't even care. It was already an amazing day, right? Yeah. It's not even 9 o'clock in the morning yet. Or yeah, it's not even 10 o'clock in the morning yet. 9.42. Mm. And you've already had one of the best days of your life, probably? Yes. <laughs> Augie, you were having a heck of a time fighting that fish. You were falling all over the place. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> and then it got back up, and then it fell again. She was taking you circles around this place. That's way better than me catching it's one. It's my second time. I know, your second time and you already, you know your personal best bass is already bigger than a lot of people I know. What? Yep. What? A lot, a lot of people that I know only have like a, like a two, two and a half pound bass for their, that's what, that's for their what personal. Was. That's what your start was. I know you started with like a two pounder and now that was like. That was maybe almost four pounds. That fish was at least yeah. three. It was maybe pushing four pounds. That was a very thick, fat, healthy fish. Oh, found a little fish. Where did he go? Oh, there he is. See, look. Oh yeah, see him. See him? Look, Augie. One catcher, can I catch it? See it? It Yeah, he's kind of small, but it's all right. We'll try to catch him. Isaac wants to catch him, we'll get him. No, I refuse to catch one until you catch one. Aye, aye, aye. You refuse to. Let me see your, this one. <laughs> you want to use mine? Yep. We're there he is, see him? Yeah, Come over here, Ox. Hey, watch. Watch, watch. Since I'm the newcomer. Right there. See the fish right there? Mm -hmm. Going down that watch way, though. Right. But he always comes back to this spot over here, so this is where I'm going to put my bait. So that's the other that. Right here. Mm -hmm. This is where he always comes back to. Yep, coming to it. Yep, coming to it. Coming to it. Oh, he's right behind it. You see him, Isaac? Yeah, I see him. About to right eat it. Yep. Right behind it. Come on, dude. Like an inch away. I'll do this. Now he's backing up. He'll come, he'll come look at it again, though. I'll get him to bite. If he's acting like this, I'll get him to bite. His instincts are telling him to eat it, but his mind is saying, Don't do it, bro. Don't do it, bro. <laughs> there he goes, going over there. Circling back around. See him over there, Augie? Now he's going right back to his bed. Oh, going down on my bait. Oh, here he goes. Here he goes. Oh, got him. Oh, no. I missed him. He's a smart one. I missed him. I literally just saw him on a wave at the end of it. He took the little teeny tiny tail. I know, I saw him in his mouth. I'm like, what's in his mouth? He's gonna choke. He's gonna choke. So I'm gonna use right there. Huh? <laughs> if you want, but you said you didn't want to catch him. Try to cross. Oh gosh. Well, don't mess it up. <laughs> okay, I just trying to get it. It's all right. If he does, he does. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Did you get him? Yep. Nice! Yeah! <laughs> I wasn't even coaching you or anything. I know. Like, Rizy got, Rizy got to the ground, he went for it. I saw him just eat it. Sweet, dude. I wasn't even I mean, watching. I mean, it wasn't big, but... I think I have this yep. No, literally. <laughs> Rizy, Our first... like, before it even touched the ground, it yep. immediately caught him. Sweet. Okay, good job, guys. <laughs> All right, drop him in nicely. <laughs> like I just locked him on the water, like bye. I just don't. I don't want to fall into. Good water. job, dude. I wasn't even coaching you or anything. I yeah. wasn't even looking, and you caught him. Good job. Yes, <laughs> one of our favorite places to go, uh, Elmendorf Lake. Um, they are, and, and, and I saw the, the name on the side of the truck, Lake Management Services, and I asked your uh, secretary or whatever she was, 
you guys had biologists on the staff over there because right now they are destroying the spawn at Elmendor Lake. They're running right over the top of the beds and just killing lots and lots of bass eggs and bass fry. I mean, it doesn't. I don't understand the logistics of doing it on March the 10th, right in the middle of the spawn. I understand that they have to do a product control and what have you. I do not understand running track, a track machine right over the top of the beds because I can tell you that the fry have a hard enough time surviving. They have like a 25% recruitment rate. At best, that's at way best. Best. And now, they're just going to be destroyed. They're just running into the mud, the eggs and the fertilized eggs. The lake is normally clear and it's all muddy right now. Tell them that. No, it, no, it's not that deep and it's a track machine and we were out here and they're full swing. Spawn mode. Spawn mode right now. Uh, and of course, uh, it, it doesn't uh, make us happy because we were going to catch them off of beds today or whatever, but but the bigger, the bigger issue is that they're they're killing the freaking uh, babies. Babies. They're they're just destroying the, the, the eggs. So they're yeah. And it is. I don't know. March tenth. I don't know about the sen time sensitivity or whatever. But you know, and I, and I don't mean to sound rude or anything. But lake management. I asked if they had a biologist. You know, and I was and, they, and I was assured. Yeah, we have a biologist. I would have thought that would have been a consideration in, in negotiating. The See, look. Yeah. Look at that. Well, I'm looking at the machine right now. It's got like paddles on tracks. Yeah. Yeah, it's got, well, it's got paddles on tracks. And, and uh, you can see this whole pocket is destroyed. I can't tell. I can't tell. Yeah. What's going on? What's up? How you doing? Good. Yeah. Yeah, we're just, we're kind of calling the, these, this company right now because these bass are spawning. Oh, they do? Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, the bass are spawning right now. Yeah. So we're trying to deal with the water hyacinth and invasive species. No, I know, but, but there's just better times okay. to do it because right now the bass are spawning. So this is destroying all the babies okay. right now. We just saw them yesterday okay. when the right, water was clear. You. It's all muddy now, yes, but when it was all clear, right, we there was all right. bass beds all over the place right here. Destroying and now the they're spawn. destroyed. So if I don't get this plant, it's going to cover the whole lake again. No, no. No, I know, but there's just a better time in, to do it. In April. April, after May, the after happens. they've already spawned, because, after the because, babies were already born. Because they come out here and they come to fish and they come to play, right? I but they're destroying the spawn. I understand. It's a lot of money to take care of this plant. So we're we're gonna, gonna, we're, we're, we're going to put it on YouTube and what's happening to the spawn. I understand. Here, so. I understand. We spent... I don't care about the money. Yeah, I know that's what I was telling him. Your I got management services. No, no, I'm from the city of San Antonio. Oh. Oh. I'm the park oh, park. oh, okay. So, All right. Lake management. I'm using your money you. to try to take care of this plant. You're using yeah, I know, but also destroying the spawn at the moment. I'm with you. Okay. But if I don't get that, I don't. Were you here last year? Yes. Yes. And you couldn't see the water. Yes. And they and they and took care of it. I know, and they took care of it and for they, the most part. We're yeah. Right. Yeah, no. But if you don't do it March 10th, right? The spawn, it doesn't make it sense. It could have waited till the summertime. It, it could have. Told you guys. Yeah, it like it crazy. Crazy. I can't keep up with it. That's my problem. Costs a lot of money, well, and the stuff we have to take care of. We spend a lot of money to go fishing and, and buy fishing licenses, and this ruins our spawn. He's looking into it right now. They said the first question I had was, "Do you have biologists on staff that should have?" This is just sad for all the know. baby bass. It is. There's, we got to try to mitigate between different issues that are going on. Um, this plan has kicked our butt. Yeah. This it, it, it has. Yeah. And if, if I don't get on it now, it's going to kick my butt again in another year. And I can't, I can't afford to do it. Like I said, you're talking about a year span. I'm talking about giving Should have just waited a few weeks. It takes it's me a year to get it out. Once, no. it, once it starts for this, you I saw this place day? chalked up six Almost. months ago. Yes, we've been doing it since last minute. Every day. every day, almost every day. Yes. Okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna um, keep tabs on that because I'll come down here. I don't know. I've been here a lot. I've been here lots of days and never yeah. seen that machine. So it's 30 acres. But like I said, we're gonna be on YouTube and we're gonna get with.
Well, they don't care about that. It's whatever, but... Well, the Texas Parks and Wildlife does. And they might, and maybe but... maybe people that fish here and people around here. So we're, we're, we're going to try and get a consensus. Get during the month of March? It could have waited a few weeks. It just could have. It just could have. Bottom line. So well, if I get rid of it before then... I assume we're getting rid of this because people like to fish here, right? Yes. Okay, well, if people like to fish here, well, then it'd be important... Wait, 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 wait a second. If people like to fish here, then it'd be important to keep the population of fish going. This destroys the population, so destroying the population is worse at, than this weed. At Bass, Bass Games, I'd rather you take my money and do it in April. Than do it in time. I'd pay 10 times to have it done at the right time. I'd pay 10 times to have it done at the right time. So when you're out fishing, if you're in any of our lakes and you see this stuff, destroy it. Yeah. Pick it up or let me call me and let me know. We'll yeah. Yeah, yeah, we'll yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. For sure. If I can get it when it's two or three plants, two or yeah. way better. I'm running out there to get it. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. I'll go grab my own net and just. <laughs> All right. But it's just it goes crazy. All right. All right. So. The kids are watching their phones. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very All right. much for coming. Yes. Thank you. I'm glad we have somebody at least that's concerned about the situation and not just blowing us off or whatever. No, yeah. I so, understand. I yeah. So we're, we'll see what we can do. Um, and do you have a question? Okay. Yes, sir. All right. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Come on, guys. Let's go. Yeah. pretty deep right there oh yeah they got a fish wow nice wow very nice fish <laughs>